Republican men are alpha males and Democrats are beta males. And I know Democrats are still angry that I made a video about this topic. I got a lot of duets saying from Democrats, how dare you call me a beta? I have a six pack. I'm strong. Who are you? And you know, you guys get butt hurt, but I have receipts. There's a reason why I say that in this because it's true. So Republican men are the strongest men. They care about action. They care about Donald Trump leading the country with peace. No soldiers dying under his watch like Kamala and Biden have been doing left and right. So you can tell a lot about a man about his leadership skills. Trump is a true leader, a true alpha macho man. Whereas Democrats will choose this laughing hyena that doesn't care about men dying under her watch with Biden. So she's a weak ass leader. And also let's talk about abortion, right? I don't care how many six packs you have or how strong you think you are Democrat men. Whenever the baby's in the womb, are screaming for help, their life doesn't matter to you because you think they're too tiny to defend. Now that shows a weakness in the beta and the cold heartedness of a man that you are. You only approve of men that are, you know, older or five years old, six years old. So you're not a leader to defend all mankind and that all life has dignity. No, you don't stand up for even the smallest of us. Whereas Republican men, they have the firmness of God and they say, that life is created by God's image and it will be protected. Even if it's this small, even if it's this small, it must be protected and I will do anything to defend that life. And that's why Republican progress has been made by legislation, Greg Abbott, Trump and Ron DeSantis and just Republican lawmakers all over our country saying, I will protect it with my party. Another reason how Democrats are betas Anytime you guys come to my page or attack a Republican, the first thing that comes out of your beta mouth is, well, Trump said this, Trump tweeted this, Trump said this mean thing. You see how weak you sound as a man? You care more about words than actions. And that's why you guys are betas because your whole stance on Donald Trump or any Republican is about words, palabritas, instead of actions, instead of world peace, instead of a better economy, instead of actual actions substance than just words that's why your feelings are always hurt and that's why you're going to be even more hurt with this video that i'm going into debt into depth about it because you beta males are democrats you don't care about offsprings you don't provide for your offsprings you go drop your girls off in the abortion clinic or promote that promote not being a man and being there for whenever you have a relationship with a woman you take care of that but you don't and you have you lack leadership skills you prefer these, uh, this woman that's going to lead us into more war conflicts and more stuff going on, bad economy, bad everything. Because you prefer the pretty words. Oh, I'm a Democrat man, and I'm so strong with my six, six pack that I'm going to vote for this laughing hyena to represent me in the whole world. So please get off my page. If you don't like me calling you a beta, well his life okay but for republican men share this with a bunch of people that you know because that's the truth you defend life you defend god you defend christian values you defend the right versus all the other wrongs and you stand on business on action action about leadership skills about action not oh some words hurt my feelings yeah ask any republican why they're voting for trump and they're not gonna the first thing that comes out of their mouth is not gonna be well, Biden said this, they don't care about what Biden said. They care about what he did to our country, to foreign countries and war and things that are of substance. Comprendes? Capiche? All right. It needed to be said. So again, for those in the back, beta man are Democrats and alphas, macho mans are Republicans.